Dallas has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Here's Thompson. Pass to Finney Smith. No good there. That would have cut it to single digits. Miami's gone two for five from three since halftime. Struess sends it home from three-point land. Struess has got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. They're doing what they can do to mount a comeback. In B.A., they don't have to get it all back at once. Just focus on making every possession count. Thompson with it, guarded by Adebayo. And the basket by Wood. Well, use the pick and going right to the cup. I love the aggressiveness. Hero outside. Four on the clock. Here's Lowry. Top of the key jumper. No good. And here at the end of the third, it's a double-digit ball game. Heat out front. Up by 12. And we're coming right back after this break to get the fourth quarter started. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. Well, that's what a great pass will do, right? You love the unselfish play. And we welcome you back to game four, folks. Thanks for joining us. Benny Smith plays the four with Wood at center. Then there's Josh Green, and it's Thompson in at the two-guard spot. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Well, you love to see Benny Smith look to score it inside. He's got length and athleticism. He's off on the first. At the line for two. That's off as well, so he misses both. Guys, I think what you have to love about Dorian Finney-Smith is his versatility. Skill set-wise, you can play him at either forward position, and in either spot, he's going to give you tremendous defensive effort. Boy, if you're going up against this guy in this close a range, you've got to defend with everything you've got. A tremendous job defensively. And the perimeter shooting numbers have been up since. Shot. So two free throws for him coming up. 
just an enforcer for this team. Adebayo is no stranger to physical play, whether he's receiving it or dishing it out. The Mavericks making a switch here. McGee's checked in. And Miami also making a switch. Butler's checked in. Pass to Thompson. Oh, from deep. And here's Doncic. He's guarded by Lowry. Doncic, no good. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Kyle Lowry, good. Kyle Lowry loves physical contact. The game of basketball is not a non-contact sport. Go ahead, Kyle. Doncic passes to Wood. Over to the left wing. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Where was the defense? No fighting through the pick. No rotation. My goodness. Lowry against Doncic. Pass to Owens. Thompson with a steal. Kicks it out to Dinwiddie. The three. Adebayo grabs the board. Adebayo's got a rebound number 12 here already in the game. Down low. Here's Martin. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. What a boost to have Kyle Lowry running the show. Selfless, smart, and always looking to create. Now here's Thompson. Kicks it out to Dinwiddie. Just five on the clock. Here's McGee. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Now at the line for your Mavericks. JaVel McGee. Shooting one. He throws good. McGee. For Miami, they've got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. Here's Owen. He's covered by Dinwiddie. Off to left rim and out. I'll tell you, despite his struggles at the offensive end, this team still finds themselves in control of the ball game. Now Thompson. Back to McGee. And McGee with the stop. A beautiful setup on the alley. -oop. Great catch, great flush. Time called here. The Heat decide to talk it over. And there's nothing more frustrating for a coach than seeing his team giving up a bunch of second chance points. That's going to be the main topic during this timeout. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. Over that last break, I got a chance to hear what Eric Spolster said to the team. With it being such a tight game, he tried to lighten the mood in the huddle, saying, quote, it's just a game, guys. Have fun. Stay loose. Let it fly. I believe in you guys. Let's see if that laid-back approach works. Thanks for that, Allie. The flashing that vertical of his, you can tell Owens loves rising up to hammer it home. And here is Thompson. To the middle. Yet another steal from him. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his will at the defensive end. You gotta love it. He came out of halftime with renewed focus. Heating things up offensively. Dallas has gone three for five from three-point land since the end of the third quarter. Thompson passes to McGee. Second personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Dallas. JaVale McGee taking two shots. And he drops the first. Finney Smith checked in for the Mavericks. And both free throws good for McGee. The Heat have gotten five shots out of nine to go in this fourth. Pass to Owens. Outside Butler. With the 10-footer. Here's Martin. Oh, three chances on that possession, but they just can't find a way to score. And there's Dinwiddie. That one's good. Along the assist by Doncic. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Lowry outside.
side. Here's Owen. And there's a three-second violation. Tough one. In a game where every possession is valuable, turnovers can make the difference. The Mavericks have gone 8 of 12 so far here in the fourth. Doncic against Lowry. And here's Dinwiddie from the arc. And the call will go against JaVale McGee. That's his third foul so far. Second team foul. Miami has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. Pass to Butler. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. Lowry's got eight assists here tonight. <laughs> you can see it from the moment he caught the basketball. Jimmy Butler delivers again. To the inside. Oh, uh, picked up his fourth foul. Maybe he had to scale back his aggressiveness. Plenty of time left in this one. Fourteen foul. Fenny Smith with it. He's guarded by Martin. Inside. Here's Denwitty. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. And this is a player who understands when the game is hanging in the balance, he knows it's winning time. Pass to Owens. Six on the shot clock. Here's Adebayo. Here's Lowry. Which rebounded by Dallas. Thompson's got four rebounds now. Dinwiddie outside. Well, Owens better be careful on defense. He's in danger of fouling out of this one. And I think MP knew that. He did everything he could to bait him into a foul. He would love to get Owens sent off. Two shots. Good on both. Well, this is why you run your offense through him in important situations. You know he's going to deliver. Lowry outside. Pass to Martin. Here's Owens. He's covered by Dinwiddie. Outside Butler. Let's the three fly. Doncic pulls down the board. Doncic has got the glass covered here tonight. That's 11 boards for him. And here is Thompson. To the paint. And McGee with the stuff. How sweet was that play? Pinpoint pass, set up the alley-oop clutch. 146 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Owen. He's covered by Dinwiddie. The shot's good. Owens. Owens has got four points this quarter. Shep Owens doesn't acknowledge the pressure, folks. He just stands in and delivers. Thompson outside. On the wing, Finney Smith. He's guarded by Martin. The fadeaway. Adebayo grabs the board. Adebayo's got rebound number 13 tonight with that one. And so he draws the foul. And, it, and no surprise here. At this stage of the game, they're going to use the coach's challenge to make them take another look at the call. And even with the coach's challenge in place, we've seen so many of these personal foul calls still disputed even after the video review. There's no doubt there's going to be a gray area in a lot of these calls. But at least we have the option to take a second look so the officials can be sure they get it right. That's cool. Decision. Call will stand. And as much as it hurts to lose a challenge, I think Coach would challenge that call again if he could. He really disagreed with the foul, and he's still here. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game. <laughs> he was all over the place on defense, just like literally taking the ball away and making it look easy. I mean, frustrating the opposition and making them kind of look foolish. And right about now, at this point in the game, there can be a massive difference between a two and three point advantage. He gets the first, and that narrows the gap to one. 
That's also good. So he hits both free throws. You know, he doesn't let that opportunity slip by. Very some big shots at the line. Miami has gone one for three in the fourth quarter from range. Here's Owens. He's covered by Dinwiddie. The 11 footer. Owens, no good. Dallas has gone three for five from three point land since the end of the third quarter. Down low. Here's Doncic. It's good! Ah! Big time shot. Sending his teammates into a frenzy. I'll tell you, these guys have worked so hard together. Everyone pulling in the same direction. Beautiful to watch. Time called here. The Heat decide to talk it over. They're behind by two. There's 49 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Owens. Yes! And tie game! Huge basket right there. And we just had to take one more look at that great drive. And, you know, a close game, you got to find that edge. High-energy plays like that one can make a big difference. 30 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Thompson passes to McGee. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Yeah, and you have to try to make something happen. I mean, they have to be aggressive at this point, even if it's risking a foul. He sinks the clutch free throw. He can't sink it, and that was an important free throw. Unable to knock them all down. Still, he puts them up by one. And he's doing things on the glass tonight that we don't often see. This production has been unbelievable. A testament to how much he cares about his craft. Yeah, just trying to keep this game alive. Not a bad foul right there. He hits the first one, and that'll put him up two. And so he drops them both, and it's a three-point game. That last free throw was a huge, huge shot. The difference between a two and a three-point lead at this stage is major. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. They're losing by three. 17 seconds left in the game. Your thoughts, guys? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. And it's either got to be a three-pointer or a score quickly and take the foul. Lowry, no good. And now an intentional foul. They need the ball back as soon as possible. Goodbye. Taking two shots. good and that gives him a four-point cushion yeah hard to think of a player who has more responsibility to his team Doncic once again be called upon to win a game for them when you've got your opponent down don't let him up this one's all but over hero outside from deep three-point range it's hauled in by Luka Doncic and now we've got an intentional foul <laughs> So the first one drops, and that increases the lead to six. What you love about Luka Doncic is he's this unique combination of size and skill. He can really play cross positionally. He makes shots at all three levels so dangerous. And they've done it. The Dallas Mavericks have won the NBA championship. And as always, thank and you all you can say tonight. is congratulations. We have they have done it. Soon. A lot Peace. of relief right now. The emotions swelling up from all the weight being lifted and winning it all. Wow.
An incredible display of resilience. Seemingly, every time they were challenged, Grant, they rose to the occasion. And B.A., I have to give props to the front office for making all the right moves. And the coaching, just phenomenal. And then, hey, it's a player's league. Those guys came out and took care of business. And thanks to everyone out there who's been with us through this entire journey. Take care, and we'll see you next season. with this team like that but nigga that was a great journey <laughs> where do we go from here <laughs> what's up everybody what's up everybody Nigga, I thought we was gonna do shit. Hell yeah. yeah Congratulations on winning the finals MVP. <laughs> right. Nate, my man, thank you, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I just wanna give a shout out, man, because you've been here since day one, bro. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. And yeah, that's what I wanted to ask you. Uh, when you got drafted last year, did you ever imagine this happening like today? If I took the easy route, the answer would be no. But the truth is, Nate, if I'm being completely honest with you, yes, I did. I visualized this, and I manifest this, man. Now, I know that sounds all cliche and all that, but I guarantee that every person who has won this award pictured themselves winning it many times before. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Spoken like a true MVP. <laughs> but honestly, though, <laughs> did you really think it was possible in your rookie year, though? I mean, yeah. obviously it was possible, Nate. Yeah. I mean, because it happened, you know? I mean, it's easy for me to sit up here and say I expect this all along. You know, so that's what I'm going to do. You know, one of the perks of winning a title is looking like you knew all along. And I did. All done? All right. Thanks, guys. <laughs> in the playoffs. No, nigga, we bust your ass. Second team, that hurts. Ouch. 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 You know, Jimmy Butler, fuck you, nigga, and Bam, nigga. Suck my nuts. Both sides. I didn't make all NBA 13. Who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck? Really? Mm, yeah, I'm holding the first team. Mm.
Thank you. I knew it. I knew I'd be all defensive. Fucking care about my offense, nigga. I'm, I'm that nigga you gotta worry about getting by, nigga. The fuck is you talking about? Me, Drew Holiday, Jimmy Butler, and LeBron and Robert Williams. Nigga, that's a cold fucking squad. Drew at point, me at guard, Butler at third. Ooh, LeBron at fourth. Ooh, Robert, nigga, that's a motherfucking championship winning squad. All NBA. Defensive second team, nigga. And I got all rookie second team, nigga. What's up? What's up? Who at point? Who at point? Nigga, me at point, Keegan at, at shooting guard, Bennett at, at third, for a chat, Jalen Durant. If. Nigga, 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 I was crossing niggas with that. <laughs> Jimmy stopped it twice, but still, nigga, I was crossing niggas up with that shit. <laughs> and I had more points than that bitch ass nigga shit. Nigga, what's up? Nigga, and they was talking about it. Nigga, I wanted that nigga to get fouled out. Nigga, my team won. Nigga, what's up? Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to enter free agency or attempt to resign with your team? Yeah, nigga, I'm going to enter free agency. Off season movers. Western Conference. Jordan Poole stay with fucking Golden State. Are you serious? Chris Stapps to Houston. Wow. Bridges to OKC, wow. Russell to Spurs, wow. Wow. Dinwiddie to Miami, bitch ass nigga went to the Ops just cause I left. Nigga, that don't mean you get to leave. Vucevic went to Magic, oh. RJ oh, stayed, Harden stayed, oh, Miami's hero stayed, stayed. Kyrie went to Indiana. Dallas want me to resign. I wish I would. Damn, niggas don't want to show no love. Rotation player? For real? What team ain't won a, a ring yet? Portland. I could play in Portland. Oh, Rockets look good. I think I look good in a Rockets jersey. And I'll be taking shit over. Counter after nigga, give me some mo. Four years. Damn. All right, nigga. I got you, Jack. I'll come to the Rockets when they can relax. I, I got your girl on panic. I stout my wrist Titanic. Like the one I'm on my savage. No airport but claim my baggage. Oh, I'm on the run. I'm on the run. Yo, go, go, choose. I'm on the up. The boy and the man, you're all in one. But I used to be the one that caught the bus on a bad line. I don't need transit. Only crew, no friends. When you see me, that's it. Uh, they never like me last year. Now they know my face. Trying to own a base. We be in a place. Like the K.C.D. They watch me like I'm on TV. Brought this back, but I ain't got received. Coking up Bobby Flay when I'm on this beat. Yeah. Uh, they got me in a bad place. Like rest the way. Customize your neighborhood experience, what that means.